in the case of what Sir Desmond said, uh, I would hope that he would uh, uh, issue a full and complete retraction and apology for what he said. It's unacceptable. Uh, the first thing that should happen is that uh, Sir Desmond should apologise. Um, and then, of course, uh, consideration can be given to uh, any other steps that might be taken. But I think it's important that uh, 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 Sir Desmond has a chance to uh, retract, withdraw and say sorry for these comments. At the time, those were, that, that was a legitimate point of view. I accept entirely that the situation has changed and changed dramatically as a consequence of the new variant. But I think those were perfectly legitimate and widely held views uh, uh, at the time. But the reality is that we've had four years in the last five that make up the five-year average uh, of relatively uh, benign performance, certainly with flu being suppressed and therefore yeah. being within 15 percent of the five-year average is not untypical if you look uh, over the last uh, over the last decade or so you will see that years bop up and down to very significant extents i'm saying what i have said in the house of commons I have complained about the way that statistics have been presented and information uh, and data has, has been revealed. I, I have said that on the record in the House of Commons. My comments were perfectly legitimate at the time. And that's the point. What may have changed subsequently yeah. is, is immaterial. You're asking me to, to, to comment on things that were said in November, which were perfectly legitimate then.